Hi, Mike Bamer with Amex Pharmacy and Nitro Medicine. And one of the things we wanted to talk to you about today was the proper cleaning of the DPL oral uh, LED light device uh, that your doctor has prescribed for photodynamic therapy. As you know, the device comes in this package and it comes in this carrying case. What we have here is the device and several ways to clean it. Um, as you know that people uh, with a serious infection could potentially be using these. Um, as you know, this is your battery pack, uh, the small uh, round piece, and then this is the mouthpiece that you put in your mouth. So when it's assembled, it looks like this. Um, when you've finished your, your treatment and you've used your photosensitizer and you've finished your uh, 20 to 30 minutes of treatment with the device, then you're gonna need to clean it. Uh, so uh, we recommend if the person is sick or potentially sick, then let's of course handle it with gloves and care. You can remove the battery pack and set it aside or put it on the charger. And then uh, you've got that out of the way and you can just simply wipe that down uh, if you have gotten it dirty. What we recommend are uh, these uh, Clorox wipes that are actually, they, they says Clorox, but they're hydrogen peroxide wipes. They're not bleach. Uh, we don't recommend using bleach to uh, disinfect this product because it could damage it, but the peroxide wipes are fine. And uh, you just simply take this and wipe it down with the peroxide wipe and then uh, set it aside to dry or put it on the charger in a safe place and that would be good. Um, I would probably recommend a wipe for that. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily recommend uh, getting that wet uh, like because uh, it has the battery parts in it. This device can get wet a little bit. Uh, it's okay to wash that off uh, with soap and water if you like according to the manufacturer's instructions which are included. Um, but to get it a little bit more clean than uh, just simply soap and water, we would also potentially recommend either using a hydrogen peroxide wipe to carefully wipe uh, the inner surfaces around uh, where your teeth mouth goes and all that stuff. Very carefully wipe all that down uh, and then set it aside to dry. Another option, uh, it would be to get a glass or a beaker. Uh, this is 100% alcohol or 190%, uh, 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 you know, what would they call 95 proof alcohol, Everclear. That would be fine. Uh, and then you could place this down in that. Uh, or the other option would be to use 70% isopropyl alcohol spray. Um, any of these things will generally uh, be okay to clean it. Uh, you need to leave them in contact with it for several minutes. Uh, and then uh, you should be able to put the product away and dry it. Uh, so you could spray, you can wipe, or you can soak uh, any of those things. And you have three ingredients you can use. You have hydrogen peroxide, 3%. You can use wipes or liquid and soak. And the same with 70% isopropyl alcohol or ethyl alcohol of 95 proof or above. Uh, any of those items are good disinfectants for this product and uh, we'll, we'll get it good and clean for you. So thank you for watching and uh, good health to you.